Soleil, uh, Soleil Galloway Law Firm. They do a lot of real estate closings, and we've been working with them for years. We've probably done over a thousand transactions with you guys at this point. Yeah. Uh, and then they offer some other services that we're going to talk about today. I just want to really kick it off with, Cam, what's one of the biggest challenges that you see uh, for the consumer that's buying or selling a house as you uh, are taking them through the closing process that can be avoided? Well, uh, title issues are one of the biggest things. And just making sure even things as simple as how the property is titled. Uh, are both spouses on the title? Do both spouses need to sign the contract, sign the deed, etc.? cetera? Uh, don't have to be an investigator, but just know the basics. Okay, just getting that stuff squared away before you start the process can avoid some. I mean, it's not a huge deal in the process, yeah. And it can just avoid some additional paperwork and yes. time yeah. during the process. Got it. Um, I mean, one of the biggest challenges I see is if this isn't done correctly and there's a death in the family and now you've got uh, probate issues or probate getting involved, joint tenancy with right of survivorship, um, which is a, a special South Carolina thing. Can you explain that? How does joint tenancy work? Yeah, uh, joint tenancy with right of survivorship is just the way deeds are prepared, um, which see it often with spouses, where if one of them dies, the title automatically snaps into the other spouse's name. Without having to go through any court procedures. Yes, right? no probate. That's right. Okay. And that's, that's, I mean, you guys just do that standard yes. at every closing unless they, unless the couple directs you otherwise. That's correct, yeah, because that's what we found 99% of the people want. Got it. Now, what happens is if, if someone passes away and the house was deeded in their name, uh, and some of that stuff's not in place, then you've got this process with the courts. And, and one of the ways to avoid that is to set up an estate plan, a will, a trust, and you guys do that, right? Yes, yes we do. Uh, and trust in particular, as far as property goes, uh, can avoid probate with real estate too, so things don't get held up uh, in probate for eight months to a year uh, waiting for a court approval. So what does the process look like to get, to do this estate plan, these wills, these trusts, Obviously, a will is right for some people, a trust is right for some people. You sure. ask all those questions, you can help guide sure. someone through that. What's the process to get rolling with you guys on yeah, that? Yeah, so basically, usually it's two meetings. Okay. You'll have an initial meeting uh, where we'll get information from them, make sure we've answered all the questions, and we're doing what they want and understand their objectives. And then we have a second meeting uh, where we actually execute the documents, and that's, that's pretty much it. Okay. It's a pretty simple process. Um, if someone wants to get rolling with you, SoleilGalloway.com. Yes. The website, they can go there or what else? Call us on our uh, number, 864-234-2901. Uh, and the, uh, our goal at THG is our mission is to work heartily so the communities God has placed us in thrive. And this is something that we can see that fits in with that mission and that um, in thriving in this aspect of life and making sure that the assets of the family are protected, uh, this is a great tool to use and we would heartily recommend Cam and his, uh, his crew over there to take care of this for you. So reach out to them if this is something that you need more information about. Thanks for tuning in.